Another year is drawing to a close. I don't really have anything profound or interesting to say. I would just like to look back and reflect on my year as an artist. It began with a retreat from social media and apps and being plugged in all the time. I made a lot of personal changes in my life and really took a step back to look at what was working and what wasn't. Creatively, in my art practice, I have had revelations. My head is full of dreams, I'm building ideas in a way that I always hoped I would. I've been inspired by discovering new artists and shedding the old ways of thinking and creating. It's been a hard year. I think a lot of fellow humans can agree. I think a lot of people are stretched thin. Our attentions are pulled in too many directions. I'm trying to take that back for myself. Not to be productive in the way we often talk about now, but to bring things into focus and feed my brain things that make it healthier and happier. I'm really ready to nest into winter and do a lot of painting and reading. For the last couple years, I've made some handmade Christmas gifts. This year I made a puppet theater with a bunch of hand-painted details and draped fabric. It's been such an engaging, creative way to usher in the last days of 2023. I didn't film the painting because I find filming disrupts my creative process, but I show here some of the assembly of it and some sewing, a hobby I've been slowly picking up more since last year. I hope you'll stick around to see the theater's finishing touches. It really was a joy to create, and I hope it sees a lot of fun performances in the years to come. Thank you.